What's the deal? This your boy, Mr. Good Buzz. We and y'all know to make sure that y'all go holla at Mars Hydro, man, for all y'all grow needs. They have the greatest bar style lights. They have quantum board style lights. And they have all new size tents that you can get a 5x5 five five in a regular size room, man. They have everything you need to get your growing setup going, including inline fans and lots of other things to get your setup perfect in the way you need. Make sure you go over for me right now. Make sure y'all stop going to Amazon and y'all start using the Mars Hydro store. And then make sure y'all type in the code GOODBUZZ, man. Mars Hydro has a beautiful store where everything is very available for everybody. And the links are in the description down below. So make sure y'all go there, use the code GOODBUZZ, and get your growth started off right, man. On me. Welcome back to the channel. Today we just wanted to do a review on the FC 6500 and FCE 6500. Uh, we've been using these lights for a little over a year now. Um, and Mars Hydro doing some promotion on these. So we just wanted to talk about these and touch bases on these beautiful lights. Um, you already know that they are leading in the market on the micromoles per joule. Um, both of them rocking 2.8 five micromoles per joule the fc 6500 is the photo foldable version um and it's rocking 200 2688 samsung lm 301b diodes and osram 660 nanometer diodes um and it uh they both rock 730 watts per from the wall um the fc e6500 is the detachable version I um, mean, it's rocking 3,546 pieces of Bridge Lux diodes, and they both work very well. Like I said, I've been using both of them for a little over a year. Very impressed. Um, both of them got the 2.8 micromoles per joule, um, 730 watts from the wall. Now, you can use these in veg in a 5x5 or in flower in a 4x4. Now, you have seen me over the course of three different series use these in a 4x4. Um, and they are beautiful. They are both IP65 waterproof, uh, waterproof, <laughs> uh, waterproof, and they are both full spectrum, man. And you already know I love the dimmable function. Now the dimmable function on Mars Hydro's lights have changed the game for me. Uh, so I actually stopped counting the watts and just start going from the percentage of the dimmable function. As long as you know we rocking at 35 watts per square foot, then I just use the dimmable function, and y'all know how I do. Um, with the 25 percent uh, in veg, 50 percent in the beginning of flower, um, 75 percent midway through flower, and then 100 percent during the end, and it makes things a whole lot easier for me. Now, with the now the difference between the foldable version and the detachable version is now with this detachable version, they have it so that the detachable bar. Oh my goodness, I keep stumbling over my words, but the detachable bars actually deliver a highly adjustable PPFD levels throughout the canopy. So if you wanna if you into that type of stuff, you can actually completely customize your your PPFD over your canopy uh, so that you can get the maximum amount of denseness in your buds and everything that you're looking for. Uh, so you see me use these on multiple different grows. Now this light has very has performed tremendously real well for me. Um, and I made a video about these, about this light being the, having the highest claim of micromoles per joule in the industry. Um, and a lot of people talked a lot of crap. So I decided to go ahead and make another video just to let you guys know. Um, and, and so that we could touch bases on it again, cause I have been using this light for over a year and it has stayed in my tent the longest. Now we did have the SP 3000 in the tent for the second amount of time, but this, this these lights, with the with the bar style function and they they have been the best in, in terms of footprint inside the canopy if you remember even in the last season season five we had those grandmommy purple plants and the grandmommy purple turned out beautiful it was very dense uh everything flushed out very well we had complete footprint everything was the exact same denseness all around we didn't have anything fluffy we didn't have anything over dense everything was very even uh, when it came to denseness and when it came to evenness of the canopy, man. So uh, when it comes to the footprint, this light has been the best and the growth. Uh, it was very good. We actually, we actually, uh, what did we, um, 
I think we got close to around 14 or 15 ounces on this growth. Uh, make sure you guys actually check out the uh, Patreon on this as well, because we got we actually took a mother plant off of this and we put it outside and it actually turned out to be amazing, man. We took a just a clone off of this plant and put it outside and actually Mother Earth actually decided to uh, go crazy on her, so she turned out amazing outside. Um, but if you guys didn't remember this girl, this girl turned out very well. And I actually got to grow right now. I'm going to show you guys in the end. Um, but I got to grow right now the hawk runs, man. We got the hawk runs actually going on right now up underneath the, this FCE 6500. And I actually, I've actually been using the FCE 6500. Now, I know a lot of you would be like, you would probably like the FC 6500 with the Samsung LM301B diodes. Um, but I'm actually liking the the detachable one just because it's a lot lighter and it's and and it's a, and it's less heat for some reason i don't know if it's the extra weight and the extra metal causes the other one to be a slightly hotter um yes and we did actually pull 14 ounces on this thing um with that last run we got even more from the other run and as you dial in your grow you actually do even better and better man and this is the hawk runs that we running currently right now this is today right here uh, this is the hawk runs. This is one day before harvest. Uh, this is like week 10 of the hawk runs. Uh, this is a secret grow that we were running right here, right here off camera. Um, I'm actually going to start running my secret grows in reels on Instagram. So if you want to see that, I'm, I'm on, I want to, I want to try and see what happens when I get 10,000 followers on Instagram. I've been kind of scared with YouTube. I don't know if you guys know about do, uh, do grows channel. Um, they shit got deleted. I haven't checked to see if it's back yet, uh, but Dude Grow's channel got deleted. Um, I got a strike the other day. Um, this shit got me worried as hell, so uh, make sure you guys follow me on the Weed Tube and you follow me on Instagram. I'm going to be dropping Grow's like this in reels on Instagram, not TikTok. TikTok do not be playing with weed. They do not fuck with the weed. Um, but reels on, on the IG. Now, if I get over 10 grams and they and 10 followers, 10,000 followers and they start deleting me, then we'll know why. Uh, but we, let's find out what happened when we get over 10,000, you know what I'm saying, and see if we can. So go ahead over there to IG and follow me. We're going to start dropping my secret grows like this. we just going we just going to do whole rundowns on them in reels. Just real quick, real fun, you know what I'm saying, real simple. Uh, things like this, if you want to see how this run turned out. I did post a lot of it in reels on Instagram right now. So if you want to go see it right now, um, if you want to go see a lot of it, um, you can go and check it out right now. Um, but this was grown up underneath the FCE 6500. So if you want to go check it out, uh, make sure you make sure you use my discount code. Go to MarsHydro.com, use my discount code GoodBuds and get you a discount on this. Um, and I've been real pleased with it, man. So I just wanted to touch bases and let y'all know, man. Yes, uh, over a year later, this has been my main staple, my main sunlight inside the 4x4 tent like this entire time. And they got some new upgraded versions of the FCs coming out that's going to actually connect to your phone. And I actually can't wait to see that. They're going to be controlled, um, fully automated by the phone, and they're going to be able to do the sunrise and all that stuff. So I can't wait to see things like that in the future for Mars Hydro, man. So shout out Mars Hydro. Um, and you know what I'm saying? Shout out Mr. Goodbuds. <laughs> and shout out uh, Dude Girls Channel too, man. I'm sorry to hear that they got that shit deleted, man. That really got me scared as hell, man. Like, YouTube, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Don't do that to us, man. But appreciate y'all for joining me once again, man. Make sure y'all like this video. Y'all comment down below. And y'all subscribe to the channel, man. Mr. Goodbuds, we out.